everybody. Um, it's Drew from Vintage Glam Studio and I'm here to share with you another uh, planner decor review for my Erin Condren planner. And um, this layout, it's kind of a spring floral layout, is really has a lot of goodies from a lot of different things. So I'm just kind of give you a review over all of the things that I use for this layout, okay? So first of all, um, I did use two types of uh, washi tape. I made little page flags out of the washi tape. Here I used a floral one and here I kind of used a green geometric one. And then on this side of the page I also used scrapbooking paper. Of course the stickers that I used here and here were from Joann's and um, I think these are journaling spots and these were just stickers that they had on sale. The ones that I used here were um, their Prima Marketing journaling spots and um, the writing, the brush grip writing I got from, see if you could see this, this is Studio L2E brush dates and they're basically planner stamps and I really like their product and that's what I used with some Versamark uh, black ink for this journaling spot. Now also on this side of the panel here I had um, two checklist box stickers that I had as a free printable Let's see if you can see it here on my school days um, academic planner stickers and it's something that you can get off of my blog and um, I kind of just used it for this layout although they had nothing to do with school but just that's the good thing about some of my printables that you can mix and match with whatever type of uh, planner spread you want. Okay and I also included the this Heidi Swap silhouette cutout Silhouette Cameo um, script basically. I used my Silhouette Cameo, I wanted to say. And, um, you know, it does the fine, fine cutting for handwriting, and I really like the way that looked. And also, because that day happened to be my daughter's birthday, I was embellished it with a lot of birthday themed items. These are from. Um, uh, they're called Onor Tech Decoration Scrapbooking Craft Stickers, but you can usually look under Amazon or Etsy under Korean uh, Diary Stickers, and that's kind of what I used for this side. And also these little spots of color, and I kind of individually cut these little flags, were from a package called Wrappables Decorative Patterns. Um, sticker set and you can also get that on Amazon. Now on this side of the page I used um, tiny little stickers to create or to mark off the weekend. Again I used the Prima Marketing um, journaling uh, spots and then I used this heart from Heidi Swap which uh, I thought was really cute but it's a little bit kind of puffy and if you heard me in previous videos I like puppy stickers only when they're kind of flattish because I don't like them to create a lot of bulk in the planner then you can't even close it. Now another thing that I wanted to share was this beautiful um, this is the mini tassel by Hot Pink Fluff. I think they're gorgeous. They're very well made. Um, I know there's a lot of other Etsy sellers that have really nice products as well but that's kind of who I went with for the yarn and embroidery thread tassels. And I also wanted to show you, again, um, these page flags that I hand cut myself, and they're part of uh, the layout that I have here. Anyhow, that pretty much summarizes everything that I did for this layout, for this floral um, summary theme for the week in August, from the 17th to the 23rd. Okay, so thank you for joining me, and we'll talk to you next time and uh, hopefully you'll like or subscribe or comment on my channel. Thank you, bye.